Hello it's Design Me in this tutorial I will tell you how to create a new blog post in WordPress. Step 1. Log in to WordPress Go to WordPress login panel and log in with your username and password. You'll then be taken to the WordPress dashboard. If you were already logged in, you'll go straight to the WordPress dashboard without having to log in again. Step 2. Create a new post There are several ways to add a new post, the easiest way is to hover over the Posts tab and click Add New. In Post tab there are four options. One is to see all posts already available. Second is Add New Post. Third is Categories and last one is Tags. So come into Main Point which is to add post. For this purpose hover over the Posts tab and click Add New. Page is loading its menus. It will take a time to load its all gadgets and post page section. Our post page is loaded successfully. First have a look on buttons available on this section. On left side it's a toggle block inserter. Second one is tool button. In middle of the page section there are two blue buttons one to edit your post page with Elementor and to load templates kits. On right side of the page one is save as draft button, other one is preview your page and publish button. Last one is setting of the all section of the page. Before we are going to start our project I am going to introduce you Elementor. The Elementor website builder allows WordPress users to create and edit websites by employing the drag and drop technique, with a built-in responsive mode. Here I will teach you how to edit post page with Elementor and WordPress page builder. So we will cover this in two sections. First I am going to edit it with WordPress page builder. For this purpose I am going to write post title. Put the title of your post in the first box at the top that says enter title here. So I am writing this as, it is my first blog post, enter body content The big box below the title box is where you put all the text, images and other content that makes up your new blog post. The WordPress editor provides you with formatting tools like bold, italic, paragraph alignment, styles, lists and a bunch of others. Choose an image here you can upload image from your computer or choose it from media library which was already uploaded you also have an option to add external image links to show. So I am going to add image from my computer memory. Click upload button, select image from computer, and upload it. Image is now uploading it will take a second or a minute. After adding title and image you will also add other option as well, so after image I want to add paragraph. So enter your content which you have. The WordPress editor provides you with formatting tools like bold, italic, paragraph alignment, styles, lists and a bunch of others. After writing all body content you will see your page blog in preview section. Preview section has three options to preview your post. One is desktop view second is tab and last one is mobile view. So preview your post with preview button. Finally our blog post is ready. Congratulations it is your first blog post. It contain images, paragraphs and much more. Our first part is completed now. So come into second editor option which is Elementor editor. Where you can create and edit websites by employing the drag and drop technique with a built-in responsive mode. So click edit with Elementor button from middle of the page section. Elementor section is now loading it will takes a time to load its all gadgets. It's Elementor dashboard layout. On the left side, you'll see the Elementor sidebar with all the drag and drop features you can use to build your web page. Elementor editor consists of three main building blocks. 1. Sections 2. Columns 3. Widgets so same like previous exercise I am going to repeat it in Elementor. So add a heading by drag and drop button and write your blog title in this heading. After this I am going to add image for this purpose have to add image gadget section first then upload image just like explained earlier. After this add your paragraph section. After completing all section publish this and view your changes. Now our two editor methods are completed now. 
In this section we have learn how to edit and publish our first blog post from BASIC.